Welcome to What Are the Odds? I'm Maria Marino along with Chris Williamson. And odds are out on who will be picked first in the NBA draft, courtesy of DraftKings Sportsbook. The favorite is LaMelo Ball at plus 100. So if you were to put down 100 bucks, you would win 100, doubling your money. And right behind him is Anthony Edwards at plus 125 and James Wiseman at plus 150. So Chris, my question is, if you were the New York Knicks and LaMelo Ball was available, would you take him? I definitely would, Maria. I mean, the Knicks have been looking for a point guard for, I feel like, forever. They've rotated from Frank Nielakina, Dennis Smith Jr., Alfred Payton the last year. They don't know what they're going to do for the next year. I think LaMelo Ball has the most potential out of all the prospects coming into the 2020 NBA draft. 6'7", elite vision. This guy is one of the best passers in the draft. Yes, he needs to work on his shooting and his shot, as some of the things that Ian Begley has mentioned with the scouts that he's talked to. But this is a guy who wants the spotlight in New York City. He craves that. The cameras have always been on him and his brother. So it won't be a matter of, oh, it's too big, or he's not going to be able to handle the spotlight. He's going to welcome it like he was. And somebody mentioned uh, he's like a Kardashian, except with talent, uh, which I thought was really funny. Only thing I would question is about his fit with R.J. Bear, as the, the shooting abilities of both of them is not that great. So that's the only concern I have. Well, Chris, I couldn't agree with you more. I think you nailed it as far as the Knicks needing a point guard for so long. I think Ball has the potential for that. And what I found interesting about his shooting percentages, although they are low, he still averaged 17 points per game in the NBL, which I think is a good sign. And you also mentioned the skills he does have, which are so valuable, that court vision, the ability to stuff the box score. And anything that he is deficient in, I believe he has the ability to improve on. The reporting by our Ian Begley on SNY.TV indicated he's got the work ethic. You already said he's used to being in the spotlight. So I am cool if the Knicks were to make that pick. And Chris Williamson, I'm certainly cool with you. Thanks for being here with me on What Are the Odds? Mm -hmm.